walking behind me alongside Gina Bacola. Going to bring in one more member right now, and that is Simon Bray. And Simon, race number four here, three-year-olds, lightly raced three-year-olds. Some, some horses, first-time starters, others lightly raced. How does the body language for these horses look to you on the racetrack? Well, we're talking about a maiden special weight at Santa Anita, so the majority of them all look good. They all look good. They're well-bred individuals. They're uh, trained by good connections that present their horses well on the track. So there's very little between them, but one that stood out to me was the two, Y2 for trainer Mike Mikowski. I think this horse is going to improve. You can see he's a little tighter. I watched him run in his debut, and he's got a little less flesh right in here, a little tighter. He's uh, much better out of his last race. He's got a good shine to his coat. That's what you're looking for. And it's much easier to tell how these horses are looking with their chestnuts because they shine so well in the sun. So indication of a horse's well-being is on the inside is how they look on the outside. So I think this horse is going to run a really big race. Bear in mind, he was 44 to 1 behind some of the favorites last time out, the man and, and the, uh, the Ted West runner, New Summit. I think he's going to outrun those odds today. Of course, he's much lower. But to me, he's a horse that's improved markedly out, markedly out of his debut. He looks a lot fitter, healthy, and I think he's going to run a really good race. He's much sharper in the morning in his workouts, and I like that as well. A horse who broke slow in his debut and now comes out of that race with a bullet work. That's a good indication to me he's going to be laying a lot closer. Three lengths back to Y2, chased after them, then comes Force. They're at the top of the lane now, and the man goes up to get the lead. The man now kicks for home. Down the center of the track, Y2 is chasing gamely. On the inside, New Summit tries to re-rally. The man is the leader with a 16th to go. New Summit's all hot on the outside, Y2. Y2's coming fast, Y2's got him. Y2 up to win it. Y2 beat the man. New Summit was third, and Force was fourth. And that's why we bring in Simon Bray before the show to see how the horses look in the post parade. It's Y2, a second time starter for Mike Makowski and Victor Espinosa, just to grind down the man who would go off as your three to two favorite. I don't think even Nostra Simus could have predicted the four <laughs> pushing the pace, though. That really, that really changed the whole complexion of the race. Why is the four, who's cutting back from a mile and a 16th, going to be part of a four weight duel and set it up? If the four doesn't push the pace, the seven probably wins this race, or the four sits a great trip behind. Really weird tactics from Nakatani. Didn't see that one coming.